Hi Scorpio, welcome to your August 2016 tarot reading. And make sure to check for your moon sign and your rising sign as well. And before I pulled your cards, I felt like there was like the sense of determination. Like you have a lot of willpower this month. And I saw Aries the Ram and Capricorn the Goat, you know, climbing up the mountain. And I feel like, yeah, you, you've got that that confidence and that wanting to move forward like Aries the Ram and also the determination and patience as well to, you know, keep moving up like Capricorn. And I feel like you do have a lot of patience this month, but also like stubbornness and willpower. It's like you're not letting anything stop you, you're not letting anything get in your way and you're moving forward. With the main focus, the Empress card, you know, I feel like you're just really enjoying the moment. You know, this card represents a sign of Venus, and, you know, Taurus, you know, Venus rolls over Taurus, and Taurus is all about enjoying the luxury, you know. <laughs> you know, enjoying what's in front of you, you know, the material, or, you know, just enjoying nature. Enjoying what's, you know, what's real, <laughs> what's in front of you now. Enjoying that nice glass of wine. Sitting in that nice, comfy sofa. You know, enjoying nature. Enjoying the moment. Smelling the roses. And also with the Empress card, I do feel like there is a sense of leadership as well for you. And yeah, and I feel like you, you're like being the own authority of your own life. You know, you're moving forward. There is a sense of like leadership coming from you as well. And with the Honor Gaia card, yeah, I feel like you're really patient. You know, you're like Capricorn. Capricorn is very persistent. You know, they don't care how hard they have to work towards something or how long. You know, they keep going. I feel like you're seeking things to the very end. And yeah, with the Honor Gaia card, you know, Earth energy is more slow, more patient. There's a healing quality about it. And I feel like, you know, you are spending wanting to spend more time out in nature and, you know, that, that's very healing for you at this time. You know, you're very in tune to, you know, very nurturing energy this month for sure. And I feel like you are wanting to just enjoy, you know, life's little luxuries as well. You know, savoring that piece of chocolate or, you know, looking at that beautiful sunset. You know, just enjoying the beauty and the nice things that are around us. You know, you're enjoying what's real. <laughs> what's right in front of you. Alright. And your chakra focus is the throat chakra this month. And yeah, I feel like you're ready to express your truth. And yeah, communication is important. And yeah, and you're just... Yeah, you're seeking the truth. And you're following what you feel is right. You're following your own truth. Your own path. And I just feel like you're not taking no for an answer there. And you guys are a very patient sign. You guys don't give up. You guys are a fixed sign. And, yeah, once you have an idea about something, you follow it through. You know, and that's good. It's good to keep following your dreams, even if they take you a long time. Even if they take you ten years, you know. If it's important to you, you'll see it through. All right. And for the beginning of the month, you've got the Three of Wands and Stay Strong. I feel like you have had to have a lot of patience to get to where you are now. And, you know, you are going to be moving forward here. This is the, uh, the card that means this, the Sun and Aries. No, the Sun and... Yeah, the Sun and Aries. And like I said, I saw the, the sheep and I thought, okay, that's Aries the sheep, you know... You're moving forward like that. I feel like there's a sense of boldness. I just feel like you're like, you're moving forward no matter what. You don't care what's in your way, what people think. You don't care. You're not letting people talk to you. That's what I'm saying. You don't care the obstacles that you got to go through. You're just moving forward. You know, you got your mind made up and you're like, that's it. Don't care if I got to climb over this mountain. I'll just do it. I'll jump over it if I got to. <laughs> you know, that's your attitude. Um... Yeah, and you have a lot of strength. And, you know, keep staying strong. It's really good. Alright. And for the middle of the month, you got 
Six of Wands, and here are the Ancient Ones. I feel like this, you know, this is, this card is all about, it's like being recognized, like, it's like a reason to celebrate, it's like people are celebrating you, or like, you're being some sort of positive attention. You know, this card is Jupiter and Leo, it's like, People are appreciating you, you know, your creativity, just, you know, just you in general. It's like, this is the time to celebrate Scorpio. <laughs> so yeah, there's definitely things that you should be proud of. It just seems like you're accomplishing something. Like I said, I feel like you're seeing something to the very end and yeah. So, yeah, you should be proud of yourself this month. Yeah, I just feel like you have a lot of patience and, and everything. But it just seems like something that you're doing is being appreciated or recognized in some sort of way, which is good. Um, really happy for you about that. Yeah, so just keep expressing yourself. You know, keep being the very unique person that you are. You know, keep it, Leo's all about expressing yourself. Keep expressing your truth. Like I said, the throat chakra, that's your focus. You know, keep expressing your truth or something. And I just feel like that's a good thing. Something, you know, when we express our truth and, you know, we're really following our passions, the whole world benefits. You know, you may have some sort of unique perspective that, you know, really benefits others. I just feel like, yeah, you're helping others through some sort of expression. You know, this might be art. You know, maybe you're in some sort of play or just, you know, something creative, but it's like you're making a statement with it or writing some music. I don't know. But I mean, this could even be, you know, sewing or just anything in which you're expressing yourself. It's like it's very healing towards others as well. Whatever you're creating benefits others as well. So thank you for that. And um, here are the ancient ones. I just feel like you have a lot of wisdom. It's like I was saying, you have, you have a unique perspective. And I feel like it would be really great if you shared that. You have a lot of wisdom to share. I feel like other people would benefit from that. So, yeah, don't be afraid to express your wisdom this month. And, yeah, I feel like it's going to be appreciated in some sort of way. Yeah, it definitely will be, you know, I feel like it will be, anyways, like, appreciated, you know, especially with this card here. And, you know, you'll be recognized in a positive way. All right. And for the end of the month, you got the chariot. And see yourself in nature. So, you know, you could be traveling. You could be seeing new things this end of the month. Literally, for some of you, this card could be traveling. Um, I feel like, though, in general, some of you are really wanting to slow down this month. And, you know, it's a good season to enjoy nature as well. And, you know, I feel like some of you are wanting to take advantage of that. So, it's the end of the month. You know, maybe you're taking a nice Sunday drive somewhere. I don't know. But, yeah... Um, and for others of you, I just feel like you're moving through obstacles. It's like what I said. Like, I feel like you don't care the obstacles are. You're like, I don't care if somebody's going to put a big brick wall right in front of me. I'm getting to my destination. I'll just climb over that brick wall. Like, it's like you're mowing over <laughs> the fence. You don't care. You're, you're moving forward here with the chariot. And I feel like you are. You have been taking things one step at a time. Like I said, with the earth energy, I felt like you had this month. You're taking, not cutting any corners. You know, this card represents cancer. Cancer's got that shell, that armor, that protection. So does he. He's got that armor right there. So, I don't feel like you're moving forward, like, foolishly. Is what I'm trying to say. Um, definitely have prepared a lot. For this. 
you know, you definitely prepare a lot. This hasn't been a, just a foolish, off the wind move. You, it's like Capricorn. You've been building the foundation after the foundation. You know, you've been putting a lot of work into whatever this is, and now I feel like you're ready to take off with it. Now you're ready to take off with some dream. All right, we'll have a wonderful month, Scorpio. Much love and many blessings to you all. Bye.